everybody, super excited to be checking out The Ascent today. It is a new cyberpunk co-op or single-player RPG that is a looter shooter. So it's a little bit Borderlands, a little bit Shadowrunner cyberpunk with the setting. Looking forward to checking it out. This is a sponsored stream. Thank you to Curve Digital for the sponsorship. You can look in the video description on YouTube to find a link to check it out for yourself. If you're in the Twitch chat, you can type exclamation point The Ascent. You can go to Steam and type in The Ascent. It just came out today. Let, let's get started. Single player, uh, new game. I will select save slot one, and uh, let's let's figure out what's going on with the story here. The way I understand it, the, it is a, an alternate history, perhaps, or maybe where the world is headed to, where one mega corporation uh, controls everything, including the fulfilling uh, fulfillment of your basic needs for food, water, and oxygen. Uh, but what happens when that megacore goes out of business? Could we still survive? Most pay the hefty price of passage by contracting away their lives to the corporations as indentured laborers called indents. Uh, tabs or spaces, chat? Tabs or spaces? Slaves in all but name. This is what's going to happen after Scarlett Johansson uh, sues Disney for all they're worth. This is what Los Angeles is going to look like. I'm a tab man, I got to admit. When it comes to programming, I'm a tab man. And then also, I know you might hate this, but I am a curly brace on the same line as the method name. I know that's very controversial, but I do see some Korean text, but I haven't called it out yet because I don't know what any of it means right now. Oh, we're getting we're, we're down in the pits, but we're not down for the count just yet. That's me right there. I'm I'm going to um like, you might think that because this doesn't represent who I am, I would love to change everything. You're not wrong. The first thing I'm going to change, though, is those pants. What are those? And hey, look at this is what all jeans look like in 2005 when I was in 11th grade. We were rocking, like, not quite Jinkos, but it was like, why would I ever have, like, slim fits when I could wear boot cuts? They're so much more comfortable, and it makes it look like, you know, your Nick Bruiser from Super Punch-Out!! Yeah, that's almost there. Um, I would say that's more like me. And then, mm, I wish I'm thankful I'm not. Mm, I don't know about that one. Um, I, you know what? Put, put me as a number. Put me as a number one for now. Too much hair. I'm. Go don't worry about the hair, okay? I have a, a clearly unblemished face and body and and this is pretty much what it looks like right here it's, it's something like that um hairstyle any game with bald is uh is cool with me i do uh, i miss when games allowed you to have the horseshoe though maybe in dlc hair color i'm probably brown one not that it's gonna matter too much maybe if he if he grows a mustache over time um Blood Direct. Uh, I don't know about that one. That's a little mesh shirt. Tacky. Tacky? That's me. Yeah, yeah. Shirtless? <laughs> Absolutely not. I would say I'm tacky. And then uh, I, you're really not going to let me change the pants, huh? If that's what I got to be, then that's what I got to be. Confirm me. I have finished my character. Yo. Wasn't Dan looking for something like this today? He ended up playing Garena Free Fire. I don't want to fight yet, okay? I don't have a gun. Oh, if you'll excuse me. Conduct any repairs that are necessary. I will do my best. For now, I'm just going to walk as much as I can. 
Perhaps I will look at a data pad. Everything is functional and broken at the same time, as always. The soups are doing their job. Flying scraps are welding their little silicone hearts contender. And I still don't really get what the walking monos are up to. All in a day's work. Signed, Byron. Yeah? Well, how about this, Byron? A little health pack? Can't pick it up yet. I don't, I don't, I don't own a backpack as of the present. Oh, my health is at full capacity. I mean, we, we've got to work. This looks like my Industries of Titan colony. Press crouch and you can navigate under hanging obstacles. Little moonwalk crouch. They don't teach you that in P90X. <laughs> Skirt. Oh, there we go. Dude, I miss when every game looked like this and came on a $95 CD-ROM. You know, we used to do, like, there was a weird era in video games where everything was, like, lovingly created, nearly photorealistic, pre-rendered backgrounds. And then just on top of that, they would have, like, Christopher Walken in a 32-bit, in a like, bit-crush nightmare video feed. Those were the days. Interact with objects using F. Uh, I've, I, my access has been denied. Never mind. Okay, I don't, I don't know. I don't know about this guy right here. I will investigate this uh, dead body. Uh-oh. <laughs> I think he was going to take a shot at me. Press O at any time to bring up your current objective. That's actually, like, incredibly useful. Oh, that's... Probably one of the best additions in, in modern video game history, but you gotta peep this. I mean, what do we got over here? I got eight U creds. Access denied no longer. Uh oh. Acquire more map segments as you reach new zones. Your IMP won't let you be. They try to shut you down on Twitch TV. They will automatically survey and download the relevant maps for the current zone and store them in your journal. M. I think I'm, just give me a second. I'm going to crank up the volume just a little. I think I got it a little low. There you go. <clears throat> I feel like this dude. You know what it looks like? Is it, it, This looks like Jabba the Hutt's uh, courtier. I'm Trummer. Hope you came armed. Well, I mean, look at this, man. Come on. SI's locked itself in a recursive void loop. Whatever caused it is beyond that door, together with a whole lot of ferals. Take my gun. Took a fat bite out of me thigh. You'll help out, right? Except. He lifted the lockdown! Yo! Thank you so much, Trummel. Trummer. <laughs> um, investigate the cause of the SI shutdown. I will. I can't help but feel like at some point we should have like a, a gun. Because I, I worry that we're about to get involved in combat. And I'm, I'm scared that I like... Whoa! Oh! It happened so fast. I am going to just raise my cam as well and then I think we're good to go. Put myself like right here. All right, we got 16 bullets in, a, in our cyber blunderbuss. Hack everything within cyber deck reach by holding C. Many objects in the world require a cyber deck capable of hacking that particular type. Okay. What your cyber deck can hack is indicated by the color yellow. Doors and chests can even be protected by more and complicated ICE and as such require even more powerful cyber decks. I do love um, being able to hack things in video games. Look at that. And, and they didn't even make us go through like a uh, a ridiculous mini game where we had to like connect a bunch of wires or pipes or something like that. Instead, he just he keeps the thing on him. You cool? Are we cool? Use left click to fire or you can reload uh, with R. I'm ready. Look at that. This That's not ammo. It's U creds. You cool? You're cool? You're cool? You're not cool. 
Yo, he just bolted, dude. I have no more bullets, by the way. Never mind. It has unlimited ammo. I just needed to reload. <laughs> okay, okay. Saved, saved, saved. Hackable? Hackable? I keep the thing on me. Thank you. 112 Ucreds? We just, like, doubled our net worth in a single burst here. I know it says go this way, but if it says... Oh, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. If it says go that way, that means there must be something to handle over here. Quick little hack. Mid-fight mid hacking. Health pack for 50. I feel, excuse me, my access has, has been denied. I can't make it in. When you burst, but she keeps leveling. What you see versus what she sees. I love that he pulls out his little, like, hacking iPad. Yo, you got Netflix on that thing? I mean, it's, it's the future. You got, um, cyber Netflix on that thing? Aim high by holding right-click to shoot over small enemies and obstacles. You also inflict more stagger when lifting your gun. Okay, but how do you hold it sideways? Broad. Oh, he, I thought he was on my team because he. I, I thought it was... I thought Broad was like, you know, the way that we say bro in the future or something like that. I, he, they, they organized the gank. Excuse me, I would like to access the terminal. Power readings are erratic. Current repair protocols invalid. Well, I think I could have told you that, quite frankly. Herp. Okay, remember, herp is not... That is not how you say hello in cyber English. I just hope I never have to shoot these. Oh, you... Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just realized I accidentally learned about the dodge roll in advance of when I was supposed to learn about the dodge roll. Who would have thought it would be space? Okay, do robots, please don't attack me right now. I I'm in the middle. It's been a hard day at work already. Not on stream. But just, uh, you know, I we're walking around in like pure garbage. Like we're just surrounded by detritus at all times or as my my UK viewers would say detritus full HP plenty of U creds so what what I've heard about the game what I've read about the game is that there's a lot of loot and it has RPG mechanics, so you can basically... Like, you can play co-op in, like, a party. Uh, you can play uh, two-player, or you can play single-player. And, and it works for all of them. But you can spec yourself however you choose to be more of, like, a hacker. More of a support. More of, like, a DPS shooter. So I didn't mean to go off on the robot. I apologize. As far as I'm concerned, by the way, this is how, like, all... Even, like, uh... PvP games should take place on a on an isometric viewpoint. Like you thought Therpy was uh, resinous because you could see around corners. How about uh, being able to see over walls? Stop pushing the robots. I'm a friend of the robots, but you got to remember, like they serve us, not the other way around. Okay, at least for now. I don't know how it works in, in the in the future world of the ascent. Yo, look at this guy. I don't know, you can't really see it. He's a big old like these robot dogs over here. I'm waiting to get pounced upon. Another great thing about top down, uh no motion sickness. Works very well if you're an old man with a busted inner ear like me. Be cautious around people in dangerous areas. Some people don't attack on sight and will let you leave. If you don't, be ready for a fight. Not one more step. Not one more step. Hello. I didn't I didn't take another step. They they lied to me in their ultimatum. Well, nevertheless. <laughs> it's on sight. 
What do you got here, though? Oh, the the Hab Defender PPW. That seems like a Montreal Canadiens Twitter Twitter account name. Tap F to pick up weapons and armor to place it in your inventory. Press and hold F to equip it. Okay, yeah, you can use the middle mouse wheel to scroll between weapons. Is everything on limited ammo? Memory purge, Memory purge complete. We're almost uh, to our first level as well. I mean, when we're talking about uh, P PF10 supervisor hat, equip immediately. Oh, nobody tell Dan. We're Johnny Mnemonic. Look at that. Um, plus cosmetics. Um, but that that's where you, you figure out if an RPG has the... Oh. Has what you're looking for, right? When you look at those skill trees, and you, I remember when I, the first time I played Diablo 2, you look at the skill tree and you think to yourself, like, oh my god, I'm never gonna get to like Armageddon or Ice Wall as the sorceress or anything like that. Before you know it, you're level 60, you're doing Mephisto runs with, you know, a, a systems administrator. 22 years older than you, who's from a state in America you've never been to, and your best friends. It's, it's what video games can do. They can bring us together. Keep the thing on me. Always crouch. Maximum trigger discipline. Not today. Go ahead. Make my day. I, I want to see that first level. Access denied. How, fail, I can't access uh, an explosive barrel? What the heck am I doing with my tempad then, Loki? Shoot it? I would never. This is my workplace, okay? I take this stuff very seriously. Well, I, did that robot just say the F word? <laughs> Edgy robot. How? How? How, do, how does one get to that loot? One day. Uh, no, no, it's yellow, so you just hack it. Look at that. You thought I wasn't paying attention? All I do is pay attention. There's a ladder on the left? I thought it was like Final Fantasy VII, like, uh, that maybe this stuff is unclimbable. I think that is indeed the case, but... Easy dodged. Oh, Matt X Powers, thanks for the gifted sub. Sorry, like I said, all I do is pay attention. It's paying attention to the game uh, instead of paying attention to the chat, which is fine. We, we'd like to strike a balance, though. Hey, I remember you guys. Hello. Excuse me, I just need to... Sneak through here. Just need to sneak right by you. I do love a game where you can free look. So that you can just moonwalk wherever you want to go. Like, as far as I'm concerned, if you walk and you look where you're going, you're a coward. I'll even, I'll, I'll moonwalk hack it. I don't care. Reboot complete. SI operating at full capacity. Return to cluster 13. Yeah, plus I don't need to look at anything with these goggles on. You're absolutely right. There's gotta be loot down here. There's gotta be loot down here. I doubt we can make it through there. Access denied, okay. I just need to kill like two enemies. If you just let me kill two enemies, we'll be able to level up. Oh, whatever you say, Jim Rayner. Okay, I'm, I'm, I mean, I, I thought I was honestly employee of the month for this. I've restarted the garbage system. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Uh-oh, this is when the, they've accidentally opened the portal to the 
Chat, what are, what are they called in, in Half-Life? It's called like the Z dimension or something. The Zen dimension. Gonna take your booty to the Zen dimension. I got the green glow under my car. I got the boom boom systems you can hear real far. I've played Half-Life. Like a lot of classic games from, from the, the 90s and 2000s, I made it roughly to the first scary part. I, I knew it. Work stoppage, report back, and shockwave grenade. Deploy a tactical with G, press G again to detonate in advance. You cause damage to enemies, you fill your tactical gauge. All right, un understood, understood. I, I made it in Half-Life to the part where you get on the, the freight elevator and the elevator goes down and then there's head crabs at the top that jump off of the uh, elevator shaft and try to land on the elevator that you're on. And then I said, that's enough. That's, that's enough for me. It's a little bit too spooky. Oh, let's go! Much like how in, in Zelda, I only played uh, in Ocarina of Time, I only made it until the uh, Jabu Jabu's belly because I got scared by the water puzzles. Complete missions, collect bounties, and defeat enemies to gain XP. When leveling up, you get stronger and are rewarded with some skill points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, here, let me. We'll just take the encounter. Then you hit C. You hit M for your journal, map, and missions. Oh, wait, this is where you take quests as well. Okay. Load out. Can be viewed and changed on the fly. That Dude, that's me right there. That was me with the Gen 1 Vive. Armor. I can tell you right off the bat. We're loving that PF10 supervisor hat. We got some free flow pants on. What's next? Meatball down my leg. Make it look like my you-know-what ripped open. Augments. So we can get some cyberpunk style augments. And then our character tab. This is where I want it to be. Skills. We got three skill points. Attributes not exactly crushing it right now. Determines your critical hit rate. Evasion, body battery, vital signs. The best way to avoid getting killed is to not get hit. I couldn't agree more. De aiming. Determines weapon spread recovery rate. Determines reload speed. Critical hit? I mean, I'm a, I'm a kind of critical hit man, personally. Out of, out of all of these options, unless this is like, oh, you get more uh, faster grenade charge. I'm a crit man, personally. A critical hit man. Yeah, glass cannon is everything. I select. I select. I select. We also got an achievement. 4.32% critical hit rate. Sounds beautiful to me. So 1 in 25 shots is going to crit on average. And I shoot 25 shots per microsecond. So I'm just like... Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry! No, no one man should have all that power. I mean, I feel like a 4% crit rate. This, oh, sorry. Uh, you know, this is... You, you, I, look, it's company property. I apologize. You can just take it out of my salary. Look at this. Okay, sorry about that. That one was on purpose. I'm willing to admit that one was on purpose. But now we're running. We're gunning. <laughs> sorry. Multiple failure reports. Multiple failure... Hey, hey, hey. Easy there. You actually are critting. Yeah, do I mean, I got 4% owns. Look at that. This is this is a uh, not a pacifist run. Let's put it that way. You gotta love a hallway, man. Don't forget to use your tactical grenade. Get stunned. Oh, if if you're gonna get stunned and critted, like honestly, we might be able to do like a soul level one playthrough. I see purple. I see purple. Basic component. All weapons can be upgraded if you have the required components. That's Baby Yoda, dude. That's Grogu! He's great. Spoilers! Disney wants to know your location. Don't call him... His name is not Gulp, okay? I know the meme, but show, show some respect. He's just a baby.
okay? Why you gotta be so rude? Grogu, yeah, Grogu, but he did not eat so much soup that he turned into Edelgoss. Okay, you gotta cross. Owns. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, dude, you know what this is? We opened up a shortcut. We're back at the start. It's like we're back in uh, in Lordran. I'm not gonna say Baby Yoda's fake full name on the sponsored stream, okay? Even though this has got to be like a T or M rated game. Hey, yo, but that bloom though. I don't. I don't want to say the words and reflect poorly on myself in in front of the sponsor. Okay, one hundred tactical charge picked up. This grenade is like pretty precious. It, I know we we just fired it recently, but it we don't get to shoot it very often. You know, it's only halfway charged up. I think. Or maybe, no, I think I'm looking at the wrong meter. Okay. This is me in uh, mixed reality streams. He looks nice. He's got like uh, blacksmith goggles on. This, he could be like my best friend. We don't need to go through. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, don't do something you regret. Papa Pharaoh? Bad start. Okay, that's fine. You know what this feels like a little bit so far? It's like a, uh, a top-down... Revenant from the Ashes, which Robert and I played uh, a bunch of a few years ago. It's early, so I, you know, I, I can't say for certain it'll maintain that sort of similarity. But it's definitely got... Uh, it's got some shared elements. Absolutely wondrous tactical grenade hit. I mean, you're, you're talking to somebody. I, I've beaten every Dark Souls randomizer that's ever existed without being hit and without attacking or leveling. And, you know, like, no boss is going to stop me like that. You're going to have to do a little bit better than that. On Donkey Kong bongos. Not only on Donkey Kong bongos, but in the original Old English. And I understood what was happening. Hydraulic slam. Augmentations can be bought and found. If they, They'll give you new abilities and work even better if they sync well with your skills and attributes. Install them via the journal in the field or by visiting the grafter. Doing it without the grafter's touch will deplete your energy. You can find augmentations in the world from enemies or buy them from the grafter. Yo, this also, like, I was going to say it's sick so far, which is definitely true. But also, really good breadcrumbing in the tutorial. Like, I feel like if they had given me this all right off the get-go, I would have been like, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. But they're teasing it apart. Hey, here's a little boss fight. Here's a little, you know, here's an encounter. Here's a little bit of lore. And now I'm like, okay, I got it. Augmentations deplete energy. Energy recovers over time. If they'd started with a 30-page PDF, I would have struggled a little bit more. I'm not going to deny it. Augmentation 1 is Hydraulic Slam. A massive hydraulic force propels enemies away from you. It was made for the Chrome Dome Arena fights. Of course, it's perfect. It's perfect for us. Oh, hello, Daniel. We're playing a little bit of The Ascent. It's a, uh, a cyberpunk co-op looter shooter. And I recalled, actually, well, first off, thank you for the raid, but I also, early in the stream, I was like, you know what? This looks like what Dan wanted to play today. While you were looking for uh, a MOBA BR and ended up playing Garena Free Fire. Okay, so that's your hydraulic punch. <laughs> it does be pushing enemies away. Keep rolling. Brah! I told you! We're friends. Too easy, man. I thought it was PUBG Mobile. He did... He tried to play PUBG Mobile. For your information. Um, but then the queue time for... Uh, 
PUBG Mobile was going to be, uh, excuse me, uh, was going to be five minutes, so he played uh, Garena Free Fire instead. Arcology Deep Stink. Oh no, it's Malf's on sweet. I don't think we should jump. Good sense of scale, though. This doesn't look like Isaac. I don't know. I mean, in many ways, does it? Do, do, what if I did this? Do, 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 and then, oh no, it's a uh, uh, Gertie. Da, 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 da. You see, I've just got Monstro's Lung right now. Choose your destination. I will go to the Warrens. What do you mean you spent it? The Ascent Group went into immediate default after the corporate AI filed for bankruptcy. One Kung Lao? Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was just our loading screen. Oh, late credits drop as well. By the way, uh, again, exclamation point the Ascent in chat. This is a sponsored stream. Um, a sponsored segment at the very least, and thank you to Curve Digital for that. You can check it out for yourself by clicking the link that you get from The Ascent. It's a, uh, cyberpunk looter shooter. It's not merely single player, though we'll be playing single player. You can play with a buddy online, or I think you can play with up to four people. A little bit like Diablo and Borderlands meet, uh, meet cyberpunk. Sound by Sweet Justice. Hello, hi, Deep Stink, man. What happens? If I, I just gotta know. Okay, it's a glass floor. That's good. Hey, in the future, we've defeated the glass ceiling. Look at that. Turn it into the glass floor. Do you hear about this one, Kevin? Do you hear about this one? Just start smashing stuff up on the street. Dude, I, can I tell you? I would hate to live here. It's so noisy. Shirt skin canary. Put that on right away. You just ran over Baby Yoda? It's hard out here on the, on the streets, man. I, I By the way, in the recurring segment, NL came up with a tweet, uh, but didn't want to tweet it because usually that gets you, uh, you know, a lot of laughs. Like 99% laugh, 1% blowback. My, my tweet was uh, gonna be outside walking the baby right now some of y'all loud as hell and that's it that was that was the whole tweet it's a little chib core that's plus two really I'm, I mean I'm getting some minus twos but I would have laughed good tweet good tweet great tweet yo thank you That's totally fine and unproblematic. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to tweet it, because you end up with people... Oh, it must be nice to be in a position where you feel compelled to have a child in the face of a certain environmental catastrophe coming in the field. You, you, you know, until you've lived... Until you've tweeted a mile in my shoes, you don't know what it's like. Yo, who's this hunk? <laughs> the feed. Speed Crush Betting? The, the Isaac Casino? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna get a quest here, without a doubt. I heard there's a genius hardware guy out there, a Carlin. Does all the mods for top Speed Crush racers. Other stuff, too. You install his, and man, it's like tip-top performance. You're on, like, all the dang time. But they say he's a bit of an impractical joker, too. Builds these little personality tweaks. Like, I hear he's really into the color red. So you install his stuff, there's a 15% chance you'll start wearing more red. Crazy, right? <laughs> Dan, did you visit this uh, person? I'm gonna be honest. I thought they said liquid dicks. And I was like, they... Jeez, they thought about everything in the future here. Uh, the White Dragon Noodle Bar? No thanks, I prefer to get uh, my gluten-free foe from the noodle hole. I don't know what Joshim means, but we, uh, 
that's our, our quest has not taken us there. Instead, we have to talk to the timekeeper. Next. Group went into immediate default after the corporate AI filed for bankruptcy one subcycle ago. All attempts to contact the corporate board has failed, and we've yet to receive an official statement. Oh, thanks for the update. Group Arcology on Velas has shut down, with some claiming it's gone into default mode. If this is true, without AG security, corporate graph teams will already be moving in on the lock tool. As I always say, one being's ill fortune is another's opportunity. Stay tuned. To all hammers in cluster 13, this is Poon. As you probably This know, guy is always blowing up my phone. I don't give a feral's ass about the whys and wherefores. Business will go on as usual. That means no panic, no whining, and certainly no This is you out. after five hours of streaming? As usual. You're right. I, I, I tolerate... No disagreements or subterfuge. After like four hours, people are like, hey, I love your content. And I'm like, yeah, of course, obviously. Shut up. Don't distract me. <laughs> Especially, it depends on the lunch situation. Today, I, I had a very well-balanced lunch before the stream. I'm, I'm thinking my mood will remain high. I'm not just here so I don't get fined. Did you see the notice about the Hab SI? Yo, oh, it's that the it's the Flash Barry Allen. What happens if you? They, I, I got an idea. What if you just? What if you just try to hack some stuff? You know, like what's this guy doing? You're hacked. You belong to me now. Oh, 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 oh. you're hacked. Death glare visor. Oh, dude, now we got the virtual boy. We got the Scott Summers basic component. Absolutely. People just leaving this stuff lying around? Cyclops, baby. Is this where we're going? Speak with Stack Boss Poon. Okay, don't mind if I do. Does the character run out of the moonwalking juice? Uh, oh, you mean the potion? No, absolutely not. This is me analyzing every restaurant I ever go into for threats and possible avenues for egress. Excuse me, waitress, could you please place me in a seat near the emergency exit? Look, when we need a company rally or inspirational cap mugs to hand out, I'll let you know, okay? Why the hostility, Poon? All I'm saying is that we should stick together in a time of crisis, and that we're here to Yo, help is that Among Us? And all I'm saying is that I don't see how you can help right now. The Ascent group is gone, and the board has gone quieter than a null space column. Maybe you people should start looking to watch this. This guy's got some the tiny Ascent ears. Not just a board. He looks like a boardwalk caricature of Winston Churchill. Of United around an idea. That is, that's the imposter. That's like high, if they make a, a 3D Among Us, that's what he's going to look like. And you would probably be played by Jared Leto. I see we shop at the same pants store. Excuse me? Oh, look at you. Positively bristling with ambition and a taste for mindless. Yeah, but violence. look at that lat spread. Guess what I mean? My PA before was pure bullshit. This is a crisis supernova. The ascent group has collapsed. Our ecology's gone into default, and we've lost contact with the board. Not that I expect those sleek suits to be able to unfuck this situation in any meaningful way. Okay, I guess we could probably swear during this segment. No one is getting paid, and Corpsick will soon realize that they're risking their necks for exactly zero Ucreds. You can expect security to implode before the cycle is over. Yeah, and the proms tomorrow. Oh, but the big ski race is today. But Johnny Slalom just injured his knee again. Who's going to take his place at the ski race? The Ascent Group AGI suddenly went quiet. That's me. I'm going to take his place at the ski race. And force the Ascent Group into immediate bankruptcy. Now all local SIs are operating independently. 
Hundreds have optimized your protocols fighting for the safe scraps. This is like the bounty board. You gotta see nutrient and energy shortages within just a few cycles. Thousands of heifers here will suffer. Am I painting a bleak enough picture for you? You're mutually dependent on the neighboring clusters for food, energy, and other essentials. Could you just have the... Could you tell your boy on the side here to, like, stop pointing his gun right at my temple? It pains me to say this, but it looks like we're gonna have to cooperate our way out of this epic mess. The other stack bosses have agreed to meet. Like, he's pointing it right at my torso right now. I got a lot of stuff in, in that general region of my body I'd like to keep intact. Okay, handle security for the moot. The turbo vipers are already trying on a protection racket. Sure, I, I accept. Enough questions? I agree, zero is enough. Okay. You won't be facing deep stink ferals, also known as... Uh, the spiders in Malf's bathroom. Talk to my man Clobber. He'll set you up. Okay. Fantastic. Side missions. There's plenty of people on Velus looking for help. Accept optional missions by talking to people with the side mission icon. Minus two? Hey, come on. You minus two me for the, the Malf spiders joke? Choose what mission to track using M. More people will look for help over time. Yo, this is a bustling cyberpunk world. Let's make sure we got uh, our main mission tracked here. Because I'm, you know, I'm a simple man. I gotta have my... Uh, by the way, Glunk, turn that off. Um, haven't you heard we're going to be in an energy shortage? We need to turn this stuff... We need to turn all non-essential electronics off, please. I am indeed a main mission Marty. Um, so my... I gotta talk to Baby Yoda, man. I'm Antine, also known as Grogu. Got an errand for you. I I decline for now, but I'll I'll come back later. I promise. Okay, let let me out of the. I'd like to escape. Use twenty nine U creds at the snack master. Oh baby, is this actually called Lucky Dan? The Lucky Dan slot machine for fifty U creds. Now that's a bargain. How could I not? I could, pro I could probably play them both simultaneously. Yo, oh, you win. I put in 150. I got 65. Now that's a bargain. Put 50. I don't even know how much I got there. Dude, I'm 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 going off. I put it in 50 at 143. You lose. This thing's a ripoff, man. Jackpot! <laughs> He's actually done. Look at it spinning out like crazy, man. Thumbnail. New thumbnail just dropped. Look at that. All right, well, that one's done. Oh, 495 U credits. Oh, man. What is this thing? Use 99? Sure, I don't even know what it is, but I'm rich or whatever. 100 tactical charge picked up? What a ripoff, man. Okay, get me out of here. That, that was good, though. Good stuff. It was a chibly stream. <laughs> That was not a comment about how we're going to the grinder district, by the way. That was a comment on the gambling aspects. Hold on. Hold on. I see loot. I'm not much of a looter, but... Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Let... Excuse me? Can I... I'd like to enter the private area. Locked. I'd like to go to the private balcony, please. Is there a way... Can I, can I get to the private balcony? Door stuck. You're lucky I can't pull my piece out. 132 U creds? That's a third of the slot machine jackpot. It really makes you think, huh? Oh, man. Excuse me? Talk? Oh, oh, hey, hey, hey. Hey, easy there, big fella. Hey, hey, yo, 
to excuse my friend, he's dead tired. Haha. <laughs> If you can moonwalk down the stairs like this, like, nothing is impossible. And there's no such thing as a coincidence. Do you consider yourself more of a looter or more of a shooter? Oh, it's not even close. I'm more of a shooter. I'm not much of a shooter, but I'm, I'm more of a shooter than a looter for sure. Dude, there's so much detail in the environments. On the rooftop shatter. Oh, oh! Okay, well, there goes some of the detail. <laughs> hello, hello. Are we cool? Are we cool? Hey, you, give me your money or disappear. Okay, he chose disappear. You guys cool? If if you're not like all I ask, excuse me, officer, can you, I'm just minding my own business on the rooftops with my gun out. I thought this was a free country. If you don't shout friendly within half a second of uh, of seeing me, I'm just gonna blast you. We're gonna operate with extreme prejudice here. Loot, loot, basic component. Hopefully, you won't get stuck by not gearing up. What I lack in. Um, gear I make up for in acumen. I, I wish that it rhymed. I thought about how to make it rhyme. I love that. <laughs> what are you going to do? Stop me. Just just try. <laughs> they were just minding their own business. You know what? Will killing you make me feel better? Don't try it. Don't try it. You you didn't you shouldn't have tried it. Oh, oh, they have guns now. When it was just enemies that could punch us, I was not feeling uh, so dangerous about it. You're lucky I can't hit you on a staircase because elevation's a thing. Whatever, get toasted. Eat Pharaoh. What is, is that, the new subway slogan in the future? Well, that was easy. <laughs> uh, skills. Uh, you know what? Why, why don't we work on our um, critical hit rate again? Take that up by another little bit. Oh, oh, oh 8% critical hit with an SMG. Now we're talking. I thank you. What are those pants? Please do not insult my pants. I did not mean to be so rude. It was not me. It was my food. I just popped up to stay hello, and now it's going back down below. <laughs> I mean, what do you want me to do? Um, the man said, will killing you make me feel better? And you really think I'm not going to, like, pop off? Is that... It, it's Edmund? Hey! Get absolutely destroyed. Am I crazy? Is that not Edmund? <laughs> you little fricker. And it's an ATM, too. I, I will become back my money. What the heck is this? Oh, it's tactical charge again. I keep I keep popping money in that for no reason. Okay, I, uh, very simple. I don't see loot, but I do see shoot. Let's give it a try. He became back his money. What an inspiring story. You here to meet my gun? Meet that. I gotta be honest, you guys have gotta work on your gamesmanship. Thanks for the HP. Oh, man. Oh, oh you got punched cybernetically. I mean, hydraulically. Look at that, it's so easy, man. What, like it's hard? What is blue? Oh, energy for our hydraulic punch. Now we're pogging. Oh, uh, excuse me? Almost missed this chest back here. Uh, the Digivisor? 
I, I, I don't really care whether or not it actually benefits us in terms of, like, it's... <laughs> there was no reason for that. I don't care wh whether it really benefits us uh, armor-wise. Like, does it look like good drip? And the answer is no. But I, so far, you know, we're getting a lot of... Uh, upgrades on a regular basis. So I'm not going to sweat it too much. We'll just go up the elevator here. We'll just, uh, it's not an elevator. That's, that's the, you would, we could have gotten crushed there, man. Why didn't anybody tell me? Wee! Hello. <laughs> it's, it's so needlessly cruel. I'm sorry. <laughs> Whatever, man. I'm honestly, I'm freeing them from having to be a cog in the machine. So they, if anything, they should thank me. They don't seem to be thanking me. On the other hand, we do seem to be generating quite a lot of XP. That feels good. This man needs a body cam. You ever considered that uh, King Kong ain't got nothing on me? Covers. During combat, crouching behind cover can be your key to survival. Oh! You can crouch and then aim over top of it like this. Okay. Like, like, okay, check this out. Sucks to be you, honestly. Why? Oh, I'm sorry, you had collateral damage! But go by and cover. Take a little peek. Oops. I'm, I'm taking some heat now, for sure. But look at that. Dude, the combat in this is really good. I know, like, whenever you have a sponsor stream and you compliment it, people are like, shill, shill, shill. They keep introducing, like, more complexity to it. I, I thought it was going to be, like, a Robotron thing where you just kind of, like, you know, walk in, pretend it's Geometry Wars, and go, like, you know, just keep walking backwards and kiting. But there's actually, like, some, some strategy involved here. Great setting as well. <clears throat> Bro, you just hit 20 civilians? The laws of our current world don't apply to this world. Hello. You think you're cool, huh? Give me your backpack. Give me your backpack. You know what? You gotta respect the swag. I've always said that. You gotta respect the swag. Okay, new, new methodology. Find cover. Crouch. Shoot at them when they can't do anything to stop you. Roll away from this guy. Maybe hit him with a quick hydraulic punch. He gets absolutely ethered like the rest of NWA on No Vaseline by Ice Cube. Oh, wait, 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 whoa. Beautiful stun. Okay, get some cover, please. They're using cover? Is this allowed? Oh, that'll work. Okay, stay crouched. Even drop the health pack for me. Ah, oh, thank you. You shouldn't have. I will say, I do think we need a better weapon. But I also think we're doing pretty well. I think I've picked up the systems. Yeah, it does seem like there's unlimited ammo, at least for these guns. I don't know, like... Uh, if you, maybe there's special ammo types later or something like that. But it seems like the systems are, are you know, pared down for simplicity's sake a little bit here. Which is good. I mean, who cares about... This isn't Resident Evil, man. You know what else it isn't? It isn't Tekken 3! 
It is in Resident Evil. It is an Omega Boost. Are you? We're not cool. We're not cool. They got you in in this world. Come on, you got to be operating with something a little bit more advanced than a metal pipe. Especially when you're going up against somebody with an 8% crit chance. Yeah, good idea. Just stand right next to the uh, exploded barrel. Seems like a, a beautiful idea. Yeah, at least put some RGB on that thing. Metal pipe will never stop me. I'm noping the frick out. <laughs> this is going to be society soon. So true, bestie. Oh, it, I will become back my money, Eddie Room. Yeah, you know what this soundtrack reminds me of? What was that game that uh, me, Apollo, and uh, Rob, and occasionally Mouth used to play? Where you like... It, it was like a cyberpunk fighting game. Uh, that was like you had one HP and you fought... It was a, a round-based basis. You know what I'm talking about? Hyper Jam! Base, it, honestly, like... That was the worst description of all time, and you completely got it. The dread. Oh, that's for the HP. Oh, now we're talking. I thought it was a shotgun. As, as a child, I used to be a shotgun believer in, in video games. Now I'm, I'm... Well, I still like the MOG, don't get me wrong. But I'm much more of a... Uh, an AR guy now. This thing, has, it has limited ammo. Or does it? Maybe you just have to shoot the whole clip first. Oh, he's mad. Yeah, you just have, maybe you have to shoot the whole clip. Oh, you, you're doing so much damage to me. Owns. Okay, we gotta, we gotta internalize the need for cover. I do, I, I've also got to internalize the need to occasionally buy snacks uh, when you see an eddy machine next to a, next to a food dispenser. How'd you see me? I was, I was doing a stealth mission. How'd you see me? Dude, this is actually, it's really fun. I do feel a little bit like the heavy from XCOM 2 right now. Or, or XCOM 1, for that matter. I'm just waiting. You know at some point, if, if my video game senses are sharp, you know at some point soon, we're going to fight a boss. We're going to get an ability or a piece of loot that's going to, like, change our, our life. We are about to level up again, too. Can I tell you as well, I'm a fan of the... Uh, I'm a fan of the three skill points per level type setup we got going on here too why not man I have no idea I just got an achievement for uh, I'm assuming killing like seven uh, enemies in like a single explosion I wasn't even intending to shoot at it the heck is a p1 protector it's another kind of gun okay well we'll check it out just give me a sec here another p1 protector it's because you blew up the cryo generator. That's all right, honestly. Thanks. To, people are always complaining about global cooling, and then I blow up the cryo generator, and they're like, "Don't do that." The bit split, digital shotgun. I did not know that we had one of these. I know I just insulted shotguns, but like, we got to give it a try. Yo, Rod Hands, thank you for the the gifted subscription. Thank you. 
Rod Hans. Uh, that would it'd be a different movie if it was Edward Rod Hans, huh? Just do it. Just do it. There you go. Uh, I don't know. IMO shotgun. A little stinky right now. Feeling a little. Uh, uh, oh, you know what? It's because he has a grenade launcher. We don't sweat those. Just watch out. Very low on HP. Hey, hey, hey. Like very, very low on HP. Beautiful. Level up incoming. We probably won't heal the full on the level up, but that was scary. Dynamic soundtrack too, huh? You got like a, a food... Oh, no, that's even better. I was going to say you got a food store in here. Any kind of food-related merchandise in here? Yeah, I don't know why the shotgun's uh, a little, little stinky. Kill the full chrome. Zero. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Taste my fist. Nice, nice to see Trash Talk has not made uh, much progress over the intervening period here into the near future. We're like two enemies away from a from a level up. Sorry, we were three. Oh, and we do get full health. Oh my god. Okay. So you go skills. Can I be honest? I'm not. I'm not totally sold on taking critical hit rate like all the way up. On the other hand, when you've come this far, <laughs> why not? Eleven percent critical hit rate. Alright, just get low. A little stealth espionage action. You know how earlier I said it wasn't Metal Gear Solid? Now, it's Metal Gear Solid. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, um, life comes at you fast. I can already... Uh, free experience incoming. There is a gun back there, which is fantastic news. Oh, uh, it's a homing rocket launcher. Okay. That's tough to get around. Make sure you get low. Run for your life, maybe? Uh, you know what? They dropped a ton of HP back here. Look at this. The homing is too homing. I, I couldn't agree more. But look at that. He's dead anyway. See these bullets there for you. Riot gun. You know what? Put that on instead of the shotgun. Rip to whoever's motorcycle that was. You know, you, you, you run up against somebody. They got the gun pointed at you like this. You say, no big deal. They start holding the shotgun sideways. You go, you know what? I'm getting out of here. I don't feel safe anymore. Okay, one of four full chromes has perished. I see them on my, on my radar. I engage in stealth espionage. It, is, it has failed me. But you know what doesn't fail you? A simple hydraulic punch. I'm telling this crit build was like the smartest thing I, I could have done. I, I'm so proud of myself for like the growth I've gone through as a human being. You know, when I was like younger, when I was like a, a, a little kid, when I got the choice for what to pick up in a, in a game like this, one of my top priorities was picking up max HP. Ew! What's wrong with you? Disgusting. Max HP? Have you ever considered just uh, trying a novel strategy of, of never getting hit? I promise, it's more fun. Dude, we're gonna level up again soon. I mean, that's kind of how these games go, I guess. But, like, you know, it's faster than expected. Let's put it that way. I do like a game where you level up in, like, uh, you know, ten minutes instead of three hours. What the heck? 
the number do go up. Remember when we were doing four damage a shot? Now we're up, we're all the way up to five now. <laughs> but when we crit, it's like eight, dude. Oh, that's a gimme right there. I would like a better tactical. I feel like the shock grenade is is okay. Don't get me wrong, but I feel like we could we could do better. A little spooky. Here's what you you loop them. You loop them. You lo I wasn't looping. I was joking. When I said I was looping, I was joking. Reload, please. Thank you. Almost got me. Just kidding. That one's looking pretty good. <laughs> please, please. The slightest bit of HP. Don't shoot that rocket at me. You son of a gun. Dude, we're gonna die. We well, literally, we just died. I just needed a single crumb of HP. Look at that. Both my eye holes just got blown out. <laughs> and then my, my jaw as well? That's too much. What the? What the? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, that, I, that... I'm glad I didn't say we were only going to die once. That happened fast. Okay, okay. Take... Oh, basic component loot. There we go. Get get settled. Get so oh, hey, don't spawn behind me, you son of a gun. These games, okay, you got... What do you do? You make yourself some cover. By killing the enemies behind you. Then you do that. It's just that easy. We're, okay, we, we're not even in the quest zone anymore. What a disaster. Hey! Yeah, it turns out a little bit of health or defense might hit the spot. On the other hand, I'm like... At this point, can I afford not to take more crits? Really begs the question. Oh, you're absolutely right. I should have tried to hack that turret. I didn't even consider it, but that that now I'm I'm just in like full left click and turn my brain off mode. It will never hit me. Dude, the staircase is like a rocket's worst enemy. That was just extremely lucky. Oh, there's the last one right there. Okay. Staircase rocket's worst enemy. We've almost got our tactical. Just get out. Just get out of there. There you go. Look, you crouch. I mean, it's a lot of enemies. But you know what? Can I say as well? Like, I'm I'm impressed with the enemy AI. Like, sure, some of them are, are bullet sponges. But they're actually, like, also flanking. Like, whenever I'm in cover, they're trying to get around it. They're forcing my hand, like... Oh, oh, they're hitting me with direct hits from rockets. They're hitting me with direct hits from rockets? We could, we could use a little defense. Three of four, though. Three of four down. That rocket... Oh, my... Okay, okay. Just, Ready for this? Attacking time, baby. Don't do that. Hack the hacking... Uh, the hacking did not do what I thought it would do. <laughs> it did not work. I need to up upgrade my cyber deck. Props for trying. Hey, you know, it it's... You got, you got to try to exercise your deus ex muscle a little bit in this game. Your cyber what? My cyber deck. Why are you being weird about it? It's, that's what it's called. It's called a cyber deck. Owned. 
Hey, quest, quest complete. <laughs> First try, baby. Return to base. Oh. Well, I think we learned a lot there. When are you going to call yourself a thin deck daddy again? You know, it's a good question. I've been disincentivized to, to go thin deck because uh, it's frowned upon algorithmically in the dailies. Speed crush team jacket. But I, if I had to guess, I would say the thin deck daddy will probably rise again. Slurpy machine? Use 149 U creds. That's that's a little much. A little snack? I, I could live with that. There we go. They're trying to scam me. Yeah, I don't even know what you're selling, but I don't think it's worth that. Go to the meeting location. I'm about to be ambushed, man. With 100% guarantee. I love a boss fight. Is it? It's the Kool-Aid man. Uh, Papa Pharaoh? Is that you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, just relax. Level sixes. You just blew up your own boy there. Like... Just a, a, overall a very rude idea. But we need to get back to base so we can level up. We're, we're going up against level 7 enemies. I'm presently level 4. Going on 5. The enemies are 13 going on 30 like Jennifer Garner. What the heck is this? Mommy? Good level, though. Okay, we got bosses. Oh, this is easy, man. You get bosses? I mean, when my crit chance is this high, like... You'd be stupid not to shoot. Stun? Get highly owned? It, it, I mean, if you're gonna fight me like a Dark Souls boss... You're gonna find yourself getting into times of trouble there. That's all I'm gonna say. I'll enjoy this. Oh, you really? You'll enjoy dying? Okay. A little bit morbid, but don't let me stop you. Too easy. Really? Because to, to me, they felt like some random uh, slop suckers. <laughs> I was very careful with my verbiage there. By the way, when you got skill points, I know you're like, what about a little HP? We could get some crit though, right? <laughs> we could just get some crit instead. I'd actually, to be honest, I'd like to use my tactical. Much more often. I love this scaling too. By the way, I look like I'm having orthodontic work done. I don't know what happened, but I, I like uh, I like that it isn't like plus one, plus two, plus three. Like now we have a thirty percent energy gain. Like that's that's freaking huge, man. Now I will never buy this game. <laughs> oh no, just because I didn't put it all into crits. This makes us better at almost everything. Hold on. Which one of these is crits? Doesn't matter. It's whatever looks cool. I do look like Ted Beneke when he's in the hospital right now. Apparently, the, who would have who would have thought the Ted Beneke drip is our best uh, our best possible option? Look, I'm not anti-story. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I'm not anti-story, I just, uh, 
and I get the opportunity, I like to maximize the gameplay. Oh, man. Already leveled up. Plus, I'm a little anti-story. Did I mention that part yet? Where are we going? Oh, I probably don't have any missions tracked. Get me out of the boss arena. Well, we got to level six pretty quick. If you mess with me, you're gonna get it. Got it? Oh, the fast travel? Utilize this for speedy okay, look, am I am I doing the streamer thing where I said I'm gonna skip the cutscene and then right after the cutscene I said what's happening? <laughs> yes, did I skip the thing that would have told me what's happening? Probably, okay? But did I accidentally go in the right direction? Apparently, that's just called having a good sense of direction. I can already tell you, we come across some enemies, they're getting absolutely crapped on. Like at this point, I'm like, Phil Collins, no, no dodging required. Look at how quickly our, uh, our tactical grenade comes out and then is completely wasted because I just missed with it. I mean, like, look at this. Look at this. Yoink. Oh, oh. Oh, da, da, da. I am feeling a little buyer's remorse, though. I'm like, you know what? I kind of wish I'd just taken the extra crit. I'm, I'm happy we got some HP here. You know, having two bars, it, it does feel kind of nice. I'm happy our tactic is a little faster. Or a lot faster, but... Oh, wrong direction. It's all right. Ne next level, we'll get some crit. We're already like halfway there. Also, wouldn't mind using my hydraulic punch more often. Can you fall? No. Dude, that's... We could use that in real life. If only someone would invent the way you can't fall off of like raised platforms. This is what we're talking about right here. You mean like a railing? Yeah, like if someone could invent something like that so that you could like not fall off of raised and dangerous platforms. Like a railing, but for safety. I hate when you go out of bounds in real life. It's the worst. Plus, like the respawn timer is jank. I don't know. The, I don't know what joke I'm making here, okay? Like a wall? Yeah, but like a wall that maybe you could like see through so you can still see like a uh, minus two? Okay, I, you know what? I deserve those minus twos. I don't always deserve them. That time I'll admit. It, it probably makes sense. In 2011, that joke would have killed though. Looks like you guys aren't ready for that one, but your parents are going to love it. That is how stand-up comedy works, I think. <laughs> the younger you are, the better your sense of humor is. I don't like I know that that sounds rude, but I don't think it is. Like have you ever met an 85-year-old and been like they're really funny? It's never happened to me. I'm not saying it's impossible. I've never met Mel Brooks, I suppose. This is just embarrassing. Level 3s and 4s. And then, like, I have a 10-month-old baby, and she's hilarious. Like, sometimes I'll just be, like, you know, hanging out with her, and she'll just go... <laughs> and then I'm like, you're absolutely right. That's some of the funniest shit I've ever heard. Okay, let's... You know, that, w that was good. But let's, uh... Let's try to actually use some cover in the future, because, like, that'll make our life a lot easier there, instead of just... Tanking hits the entire time. So do good on your promise here. There you go. There 
you go. Use cover. Easy. Oh, I didn't even see you there. Anyway, you're dead. Whoa, uh, not quite, not quite. Can we please check out the Dread? Let me tell you something. If you want to check out the Dread, you're in a great spot right now because this is the Dread. The, the gun that we're presently using is known as the Dread. So you must think, look who's talking is really funny. I mean, I wouldn't say it's the height of humor, but like if, if babies at being able to talk doesn't make you laugh, then, you know, I don't know what you're doing on this stream. You know, maybe you'd prefer to watch something a little bit more uh, in your in your humor zone, like um, duck soup. Easy choice, man. Did you watch Baby's Day Out? I've seen I've seen about half of Baby's Day Out. It's kind of the funniest thing I've ever seen. Like, what is that baby doing, man? Baby, you shouldn't be doing that. You shouldn't be crawling on construction girders in downtown Manhattan. You shouldn't be sticking your head into the lion's pen at the zoo, but somehow, you know, I, I, I don't want to spoil it for you, but despite the peril that the baby's life is fraught with, after having their day out. It's a feel-good story at the end of the day. You know, the baby does not get hurt. If you don't mind, I'm just going to steal your U-creds here. Uh, okay, well, I mean, keep in mind who wanted to do this, right? I was just passing through. You're, you're actually level two. Like, before you start getting into conflict with people, you should really look at the, their level compared to yours. Like, I, I'll, I'll ice someone just for fun, man. I don't even know if it gives me XP. I'm just, a, I'm just a bad man. What the heck? Uh, a hexagon. Disagreeable bail. Disagree with this. You're in for a world of hurt, my man. <laughs> oh, we got his bounty! Look at that! Certain enemies are known troublemakers. We're absolved! Certain enemies are known troublemakers and have a bounty on their head. Defeat an enemy with a bounty and collect proof to be able to claim the reward at any bartender on Velus. But be careful, bounties have various boosts in combat, making them tougher. Yo, it's you know what it has? Be cool, Warner Brothers. WB Games. Got a nemesis system. How about that? What is this? Hello. You really don't want to upset me. Okay. You sure? I thought about it. I thought about it. You really, like, as soon as you get the exclamation mark on your head, like, you know what's happening, right? Go away, pleb! <laughs> it's, just, it's just disgusting, man. We're blowing them away. I'm vibing right now. Oh, some energy. Thank you. Easy. How much ammo you have left? <laughs> uh, I came here to shoot bullets and eat ass, and I'm all out of bu uh, bubble gum. Does that answer your question? No? Uh, long story short, we don't run out. Wanna do it? That's not nice! Yo, why'd you shoot him? He's, he was offering us an opportunity to meet our dead relatives. Pancho? Oh, going up? Second floor, menswear? Alright, I think we're in a safe zone now. Yeah, they, uh, don't mess with that. Who's Joe? It's a, it's a grandfather that I made up. I don't actually have a grandfather uh, named Joe. But I do have an Uncle Bob. Uh, 
Joe Binden. Yeah. Joe Mama. Dude, we should buy some armor down there. First, I'm going to speak with Stack Boss Poon. And then I'm going to I'm going to see if we can get some more armor. Hmm. Hello, Yoda. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, you're hammered. Who gave that 50-year-old kid space wine? Well, lucky for you, Chad. Kidnappers didn't just grab any random hammer when they came reading. Instead, they managed to kidnap almost every key alpha and beta level in that in the class. Beta. The very people we need to keep. Hey, beta. Running. You're still cleaning your gun down here, huh? Corpsec disintegrating. I currently have zero access to the security systems. So I don't have a fucking clue where our havers are. Who oh my god, he's so grumpy. <laughs> Someone wanted to cripple our cluster. They couldn't have done a better job. I need you to get these people back. Not for their sake, but for ours. You're gonna need help infiltrating the security. But first, take a hit off this thing. There's a quiche. Yeah, I know. But he's a mean nice cracker. A real net sage. I've employed his services once before. Unfortunately, it didn't end well, and I, I might have screwed him over. Needless to say, he's not accepting my pings, so it's gonna have to be face to face. And I, I've learned that he set up shop in Black Lake Towers. What I'm on my way. Yeah, yeah. No, I don't. I don't ask a lot of questions. I'm just like a, I'm. I'm just. I just kind of go for it, you know. I know my role. I'm a hired gun. I'm not the merc with a mouth. I'm the merc with no ears. I'll circle back with you later. Okay, guns. Guns are doing great for me right now, but I, I wouldn't mind picking up some more armor. When the moon hits your eyes, like a big pizza pie, buy new armor. Um, armore. Yeah, armor rating, of course. I mean, I'm like level 7. You think I don't understand armor rating? I would like to shop. I think we need l new lower body gear. And we would like to get something um, that raises our crit chance IMO Oh and it's in ascending order of price Alternatively we could just get something that looks cool as heck Yeah hello do you have any do you have any critical pants for us I got to tell you our shirt's pretty good It's hard to get better than our existing shirt, although... Hold on. The handyman's backpack? I do like a, a leather vest. We lose 20 energy. I don't know what half of the symbols represent. But I feel like we lose very little and we gain a lot here. So you know what? Why don't you go ahead and give me one of those? Make sure you've actually got it on. Oh! And then, we need to speak to a bartender to turn in our bounty. They said any bartender. Uh, excuse me, this is a police check. I do not wish to be in here. Uh, this is... My dodge roll has gotten a lot better. Are you? Do you sell... You don't sell bars, huh? Excuse me, did I see some Korean text? Just give it a sec. I gotta know what it says, man. Uh, I can't read that fast. <laughs> Look at this dodge roll. Did it? You're gonna laugh at me for saying this. I feel like when we got that um, that vest, I feel taller. I don't know if I can actually verify that that's. That's true, but I feel taller. Like IRL. Hello, bartender. I would like to sell my collected bounties. I'll strike that one from the list then. 
I gotta be honest. It's not as much money as I thought we would get, but it is worth. You know what? It's enough money to do this. Easy win. F. Easy win. Still popping. Whatever. Who cares? Who cares? The jackpot's incoming. Sponsor begging for the location of, of doing a mission through text. Oh god, we're 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 split sharing now. We're we're queuing on two poker tables at the same time. Jackpot! Oh baby! He's done it again! I gotta be honest, the odds didn't seem that bad. How we doing on credits? We got 770 credits, man. I think that's like where we started. <laughs> oh. Still though, hey, jackpot. I like the sound of that. Alright, we got time. Certainly we got time for one more quest. You actually have 500 less than where you started. Okay. Again, this is uh, this is The Ascent. It just came out today. If you type exclamation point The Ascent in chat, The Ascent uh, link there will take you to a store page where you can pick it up for yourself if you're interested. It is not exclusively a single player RPG. You can also play it with your friends. You know, you could have one person building crit. You could have one person building tank or something like that. You could have one person just doing hydraulic punches. Or you can play it solo. I'm, I'm surprised. Usually, like, I mean, I admittedly, I haven't played it multiplayer. Um, but usually, you, you feel like, you can't help but feel like when you play a multiplayer game, single player, that you're, like, compromising a little bit. But I've, uh, I've been enjoying myself greatly. Surprising amount of, uh, of strategy involved in the combat. I'm having a good time. Thank you to Curve Digital for the sponsorship. Very fun game. Plus, I mean, the drip is out of control. Wonder, because usually, like, I, I judge my idea of how long a game is based on, um how long it seems like it would take us to get to level 50. We're already level 7 after like an hour and a half. So I feel like, I don't know, we might, I was gonna say we might be about to take out the final boss, but that seems a little, I guess that would be pessimistic. This is good battleship practice, don't worry about that. Battleship I already got is sorted out. I'm a very probabilistic driven individual. Oh, sorry about that. He fell onto my headshot, dude! Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was just firing my gun, and then he slipped and fell into my bullets. Honestly, it's like rude of him, because now I gotta like live with the guilt of having murdered that guy. He looked at me funny. This is what you like to see. Level 8. Also known as a free XP farm. I don't want to brag, but I did just get a, a deep stink rebreather. And then a slab worker's chest plate. Deep stink rebreather. That's what Mouth calls it when he... Turns off the ventilation fan in his ensuite bathroom when he's taking a poop. Nice try. Look, the point is, the deep stink is Mouth's bathroom, okay? And, and so are the worms. Can I tell you, by the way, chat, I'm bike sore! New pants, baby! I'm very excited. You know, today is my last day uh, before I have 100% antibody uh, coverage from those two of the vaccine. These are better in in almost every respect. Yo, and it came with new knees as well. Look at that. 
I really do. I feel like the Doom guy now. Guns still work. I had to test. I recently got Dose 1. Does Dose 2 hit harder? Most people, I would say, seem to have a, a stronger reaction to Dose 2 from my anecdotal uh, experience. I had almost no reaction to... Uh, remove yourself. Okay, how about I remove you instead? I had almost no reaction to Dose 2, and, and you know, I'm, I'm thankful for that. Don't get me wrong. I wonder if there's damage types. Like, because these guys seem pretty tanky for level 3s. Maybe because they're robots? I I was... Uh, I had a... I would describe it as a mild reaction to Dose 1. Uh, where I, I felt like a little simulated sickness. For Dose 2, I, I had shivers for like an hour. And then I was like... Back, uh, back on top. And I, I did have uh, sore lymph nodes in my left armpit, which is the uh, the arm in which I got the vaccine. It really felt like I had been at the gym and just done like held a dumbbell in my hand and just gone like this over and over for like three or four days. But otherwise, it was uh, it was totally fine. Excuse me, I don't want to kill a baby Yoda. Oh, you, they made the they made the old boss into a basic Taurus demon strategy. Oh, they they were just chilling. I'm sorry, they were wrong place, wrong time. Not stunned. Owns. Did you get the battle pass so you can get those three for free? Man, honestly, like, it sucks if you gotta get boosters, but I'm also, like, just dose me up, man. I don't care. The only the only thing I would... If you, if you gotta give me a booster, I know this is not how microbiology works, but, like, what if you just gave me, like, like, ten shots in a single day? Like, what if, what if I could just stack them up? That way I didn't have to, you know, like, drive back to the clinics and stuff like that. If you could just give me, like... You just give me a triple dose on the on the day that I uh, that I have my appointment, and then we can knock it all out at once. Tell me you don't know anything about science without telling me you don't know anything about science. By the way, I'm gonna die. I that guy just got shot from across the map. I did see someone say, "Are you still gonna mask in public?" And I think like. My, my honest answer, and this is not just me trying to be based, but I'm like, it's so easy that I'm like, why not, you know? Do, do my part for the, the under 16s that can't get vaccinated, like immunocompromised people that can't get the vaccine. Like, it, it's literally like, it's so easy that I, I, I don't see why not. The only thing is, no, I, I, I don't care about me wearing a mask. But there are times where I wish, like, maybe the grocery staff were not wearing masks so I could hear what they're asking me and stop saying you too when they say, like, do you need a bag? But that's that's it. That's, like, my, my genuine only complaint. But I will also say I'm, I'm sick of all this rhetoric, okay? That's like, oh, please protect the 16-year-old the, the and unders because they can't get the vaccine. You know, if your mom is vaccinated, then you pass on some immunity to your kids via breast milk. So instead of complaining, why don't you just get to nursing? It's nature's T cells just sitting there waiting for you. <laughs> you might not be able to get the vaccine, but there's nothing that says, hey, oh, I'm 14. I don't want to breastfeed off of my mom anymore. We're in a global pandemic. You got to do what you got to do. Anyway, what was it? Cut the sponsors like, cut the mic, cut the mic. <laughs> okay, I, th I think we could honestly use a little extra HP. Oh, sorry, you're not an enemy. What did I come back to? 
I'm just saying. You could, if you're under 16 and the vaccine has not been approved by the FDA for your use yet, it's no problem. I gotta, I think, you, I bet if you drank 10 liters of breast milk from somebody that's had their second dose more than two weeks ago, you'd get immunity. I don't have any science to back that up, but I think it would make a great episode of Fear Factor. Gross. <laughs> Hey, we've all done our part, okay? I bought Black Widow on Disney Plus instead of going to the movie theater to see it. The least you could do is drink some breast milk. Curve Digital right now is like... Did we put a mutual indemnification clause into that contract? Is there any way we can get out of this uh, arrangement? <laughs> Oh, you're an innocent bystander! Sorry, sorry. Well, wh why were you standing there? Oh, sorry, moonwalk. Yeah, yeah, I forgot about the moonwalk. <laughs> why me? <laughs> Is there a penalty for killing innocent bystanders? Uh, for, uh, for them, there's a, there's a huge penalty. For you, I think it, you, they just, you're in danger of getting stopped by the base patrol. Oh, that must be our fast travel location. You all, you do lose one of your infinite bullets as well. I would like some HP. Oh, well, would you look at that? Now we're talking. I haven't seen an Eddie room in a bit, huh? To become back my money. You gotta be careful. You can't shoot high on those guys. You'll, you'll over, over hit them. You'll hit over them. Eddie room? What are you talking about? You? Oh, you, he doesn't know? Hello. You know what this reminds me of? I made a game with zombies in it. You ever play that on Xbox Live Arcade? I made this game using XNA. It costs a dollar. That's why you're playing it. I made a game with zombies in it. That was... Humor uh, has... I'm not trying to insult... Uh, I made a game with zombies in it. It was a very well-known indie game. Uh, it was an Xbox Live, not arcade, but Xbox Live true indie. It cost a dollar, and it was basically like Robotron or Geometry Wars, but with zombies. But the main thing about it was that it had a song, and, and the song was funny. The developers, little known fact... The developers of that went on to make um, the, the, the super 2D Dark Souls. It's Ska Studios. They went on to make... What's the super... Salt and Sanctuary. Yeah, Salt and... They went on to make Salt and Sanctuary. No DMCA, please. Oh, mom's coming in. Close your tabs. Not now. I've almost cracked the distributed cognition. Whoa! Where did you come <laughs> and from? And where'd you get those no, pants? Wait, who the hell are you? And how did you find us? This is supposed to be a secret hideout. Yeah, I just walked in. I knew I should have gotten those turrets online long ago. Then you'd be a red smear on the floor. Never rely on secrecy alone. And again, I'm obviously still alive. So what do you want? Why are you here? Moon sent you. Yeah, I know that faithless cred stacker all too well. What does he need? Yeah, I don't really know. I'm just gonna hit next until you put a, a big red arrow on my HUD, Without and then I'm gonna engage in combat. Two nest cannon thirteen. Poon must know that the bastard. All right, I'll help, but this is not for Poon. What do you need? 
I need I security access. Today, seems a whole bunch of invalid tags passed a scan gate at the Cosmodrome a few subcycles ago. The biometrics match your havers, but so I can't say where your havers are now. If Obi took them, you're gonna have to ask them why yourself. They've requisitioned an old Hydracat branch office up by the node, way above where we're, we're gonna be now. so late Cold for that movie. Anything we're not going to the movie. Know. What? Oh, get me out of here. I don't want to be in the Coder's Cove. On the other hand, I think I do want a little... Ooh, look at that. Cyber deck upgrade. I, look at this. Who's going to hack the hackers? Me. I'm going to hack the hackers. Get hacked. Oh, let me out, man. That sketch hurt me. I got detention for saying what too much in in middle school. That sketch hurt me because I honestly think that there should be a rule that somebody can't eat all the fully loaded nachos. Like, I, I don't think... Yes, a taxi, please. I would like to go to... Arcology Warrens. Thank you. Oh, look at that. I I don't I don't think you should have one person eat all the fully loaded nachos and then like one other person just gets like maybe like mostly just chips with like one little nugget of meat. your favorite chip oh man yes. hey hey hey! that's a good question i i do love a tortilla chip man okay that actually hit i should not be so close please don't stand so close to me i love a kettle chip like don't get me wrong the only thing negative I have to say about a kettle chip is sometimes, like, they're too oily. And I, I find myself, um... I wouldn't say getting a tummy ache, because when you phrase it like that, it sounds like I'm 10 years old. But I, I find myself, uh... Experiencing some gastrointestinal discomfort between my pyloric sphincter and the entrance to my ilium. Oh, sorry, robot. It was my intention there. Is that better? I don't know. It, well, it sounded like I did well in 11th grade biology, which, by the way, <laughs> you'd be bang on. Oh, going up. All right. Yeah, we got about 10 minutes left here. I think we I think we got a chance to finish maybe another boss here. I am kind of I'm waiting on my uh, my call as well. I'm not in like a Discord or anything like that. I'm just being around at, I'm going to be around at 2 p.m. I know what it's like. You know, sometimes when you work with streamers sometimes, you know, it's like schooled was was crazy, you know. I had a lot of stuff in advance to make sure it was set up right. Something that's a little bit more casual, you're like, hey, I'm not going to be a stick in the mud. I felt bad. Can I give you a little life hack? I, uh, I sent a mess. I don't want to leak DMs, but I sent a message to Ludwig because I haven't been looped into like a Discord or anything like that. I want to be like looped into the Discord. But what I said is, hey, do I need a Discord invite or something? And then this is the tactic that I would advise you to use. <clears throat> I just want to make sure I'm not holding anybody else up. So some, it's something that you can use yourself. It seems like you're being selfless. Just a little life hack. A, li a little conversational juice. Speech 100. I did not add a winky face afterwards. That's too much. 
What was the response? I don't want to leak DMs. Did, did he say, I hope in your next life you are a cow on a trush farm? I will become back my money. If this gets clipped, by the way, that's a reference to uh, a, a shit post about the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Whoa, 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 whoa. Since when do you charge? By the way, uh, check this out. Mm, owns. Owns. Come on, just one more level up. Just one more level up. Terrible time for your tactical, my friend. Just one more level up. Dunk, dunk, dunk. By the way, I know my role in the battleship tournament, okay? I, I saw some of the names that got invited, for sure. And I, you know how, like, in a boy band, there's always, like, four great singers, great dancers, and then, like, one 38-year-old guy with a little bit of a, a dad bod and, like, a goatee, and you're like, how did he get here? That's definitely me. I'm, like, the, I'm the chaperone. Oh, an enemy with a shield? Uh, get me out of here, please. Owns. I lived. For now. You're credited as a dad in Ludwig's title? You know what? That sounds fantastic. That, that sounds fine to me. Sounded so fine, I felt like I could even use some U creds there. You guys know the rules of the tournament, by the way? I don't want to detract from the, the game we're playing as we speak. But is it like a single elimination thing? I'm trying to figure out if I should have a granola bar first. <laughs> or, or if it's likely I'll be eliminated early enough that it won't matter. <laughs> Be best of three, but you like lose one match, you're out maybe? I don't know. Single elimination. Oh, uh, that was a bounty! Look at that! Hey, how about that? The most well-known beetle is Minkus. It's both a joke, but also true, because, I mean, if I had to guess, if you did a Sporkle quiz of the of the most well-known... He got me. If you did a Sporkle quiz of the most well-known beetles, I bet it would be John Lennon in first and Paul McCartney in second. I bet it would be close, but... And can I tell you something that's messed up? I bet Ringo Starr is third, and uh, and George Harrison's last, which is is not the way it should be if it were a meritocracy. But John Lennon... Probably the most famous Beatle. And also, a little Minkus. Incredible songwriter, no doubt about that. Music is so good. Well, I mean, come on, you gotta level up. <laughs> I mean, while you're here, you gotta level up. You gotta level up real quick. Maybe do a little uh, level 15 of 20. Don't trust anyone, not even yourself. Look at the speed with this dodge roll now, like it's crazy. How much work goes into maintaining your beard? See that's the thing, people are always, I, I hate to make this like a men versus women thing. Women are always like, oh, it's so annoying to have to do makeup and, like, you know, maintain my appearance and stuff like that. It takes so long, and before bed, I gotta, like, take all the makeup off and stuff like that. It's so expensive. I gotta go to Sephora. And it, look, 
Ladies, ladies. Being a man takes a lot of upkeep too. You see this right here? It's like a 10 minute a week investment to make sure that it stays like this. I mean, if we're averaging that out, that might not sound like much, but that's like a minute and a half per day, okay? So like, I don't know why you're complaining so much. We're all making sacrifices. Unsubbed. It was a, it's satire. You know, it just reminds me of all these incredibly dedicated professional athletes who I now think are, they're so weak, man. They have all this dedication. They get to the very tip top of their sport. But I run a blog and a podcast. I think I've got more intestinal fortitude than them for some reason. Plus two and a middle finger emoji. You know what? Plus two and a middle finger emoji. I can take it. Follow up question. Favorite chip flavor? I'm a uh, I'm a dill pickle Marty. Honestly, I all uh, there's a lot of great ones. All chips are uh, are positive, but I I do love a dill pickle chip. Dill pickle chip. I I do think we're gonna literally enter here. Watch this cutscene, and then we're gonna move on. But I've had a, honestly a great time playing the uh, the ascent and meeting these combination Twi'lek Krogans from from Mass Effect. Well, that cutscene was a little bit faster than I expected. I'm 438 hung. I'm 438 hung, and you're on a timer. What, I quit bragging. <laughs> I have no idea what you're jabbering about, but that ugly speech hole of yours would be much improved by staying. Close. Great voice. So you've lost a few hours. How does this concern you know who this is? Exactly. Tony, Tony Baritone. Careful where you point those digits in, Dent. But as it happens, you're in luck. I know where your precious habits are. But there's an inquiry. And I have a proposal. The, All right, fair enough. <laughs> I, go, go to marker and shoot. All right, that is, uh, that is The Ascent. I had a, uh, a great experience playing it again. Exclamation point, The Ascent, and you can go check it out for yourself. Or if you're watching on YouTube, look in the video description. And you can find the link there. Thanks to Curve Digital for the sponsorship. Great, great time. I had a lot of fun.